Hello and welcome to Naxxramas. Now, you're probably wondering, why have I already got the, oh god, nope, why have I already got the first win? Now, the issue is, I looked at the recording, you know, just as C, and for some reason there was a bit of a corruption going on, and the video was kind of, you know, parts of it missing, audio sync going a bit weird. So, I've decided to redo this. Now I will be choosing the Golden's token deck. I have already unlocked one uh, one type of card from this. I believe it's something to do with spiders, uh, which it will help the token part of this. I will put it on the deck list on the side. Please forgive me if uh, this shows you any inconvenience because I already know about this boss. And his hero ability is annoying. <laughs> Do I keep? No, get rid of the file. Hmm, that's okay. Too many spells, though. Probably just go straight at wild growth. Because it is, it is kind of a ramp. It's a mix of ramp token. It's my own type of blend, if you will. You know, very big taunters and so on. Very big cards showing up. The whole point of it is, I swarm the board. Or I get big guys out, your decision. Death does not scare this guy is a pain, but it's actually good for this type of deck. Because once he dies, and if you read what his ability is, your you uh, your opponent puts a minion from their deck into the battlefield. This will be a downside if it is a battle cry type, say Ancient of War, Ancient of Law, your decision. Now since the circumstances, I would just prefer to draw here. Inner Fate seems pretty good. Next turn, I'm probably Inner Fate, Ancient Law, draw some cards. Most likely. It's probably just going to trade up. Yep. Hmm. Violet Teacher. I actually see a good play here. Violet Teacher. Into Inner Fate. Into Power of the Wild. Leader of the Pack. I'm ready to and there you go. Now I only have to trade two of these into him. That's the card. The Haunted Creeper. That's why he's on the belt. Ooh, he has loads. That's not pleasant for me. My mass AoE is swipe. And also we have the Force of Nature. Let's have a draw combo. Let's have a little look what we get here. Druid of the Claw. Damn, this is <laughs> horrible. Oh, wow. So I'm just going to straight up hit it. I should have really done Wrath there. Just to see what I got. Now we get Ragnaros. I'm very disappointed with the Druid Claw, but it's still a 4-4. May not have charge or taunt, but it's a 4-4 nevertheless. Now, this is actually quite bad on my end. Ooh. Now, this might be good, though. The whole point is we're setting up for the Savage Raw, Savage Raw combo. Now, that's, you know, that's why we win this. So, I'm probably just going to go Ancient of Four straight into that. No, sorry, uh, we do Druid of the Claw, Anthony A Bomb. My strength. You know, setting off its ability. we heal. We'll heal the uh damn what's it called? The final teacher. And I'll be it. This ain't now He didn't say that last time. That's actually quite creepy. Look, Julian A. He hasn't actually summoned these either. Wow, so many cards I have not seen. I am not summoning Ragnaros then. By the looks of this. Ooh, Violet Teacher. Yeah, alright. Now we got well, first of all, I don't know why I stuttered there, I was just looking at the board. That was going to be a play, obviously. Why not? We'll summon another Violet, and we'll also summon the Haunted Creeper. Now all we have to do next turn is win with Force of Nature. Do free damage to enemy minions. Wow, I did not even see that last game, but we still win, I believe. Yes, we do indeed. Do we? No. Oh wait. Oh wait. Oh yeah, we still do. Damn. 
Oh no wait we don't. Oh damn. The plays. <laughs> oh no. No. Oh damn. Well, that shows you how I play. Shaden Naxxramas. Uh, ooh, that is a nice card indeed. I would really like to play that, to be honest. Skitter. Interesting. Oh well. Now it's GG. Oh god, how could I... S oh, how could I think that was the win? I forgot two pilot teachers on the board. This is, this is how I play, so get used to it. Faelina is training acolytes to worship me. Her job is very important. Do not disturb her. I'm sorry. Kel, whatever your name is, sorry. <laughs> I don't even know what his last name is. It's like Kel Fulsan Fodstad. I, I, I played World of Warcraft 3, but I can't recall his name. It's like Lich King's most trusted person. Well, at the time. Wow, so much emphasis My on her. Me question. I must protect the mm. wild. Okay, we're gonna get rid of the Ancient of War, Violet Teacher, and Sub Draw. And we'll see if we get lucky. Please get lucky now. Violet Teacher and Innovate. Could Innovate the Fire Teacher up? Oh, a bit creepy how dark this place is, to be honest. Yeah, I'm probably gonna. In the fate that violet teacher. First of all, fire a missile for each card in in your opponent's hand. Oh damn, that might be an issue. Hmm, interesting. I'm gonna just wrath that instead of the in the fate violet. I'm just gonna wrath. But wow, that's pretty. That's pretty painful. Rain of Fire, that is the Warlock AoE, if I recall, in the Warcraft. So I'm just guessing it will be on the board. So, like, it'll work like Arcane Missiles, but against my minions. I hope. If it works every way, including my guy, this hero ability will be difficult. Hmm. In a Rage. Interesting. How am I going to play around this, I wonder? There is a 4-4 in that egg. So... Just going to hit him in the face. Oh, what was with the big lag? Oh god, the lag. Oh, wow. Don't know what happened there. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting, because in these games there will be a bit of a latency. Yeah, there you go. There's a latency, because I think it's because it's like, uh, they have to... Realize the player did, if that makes sense. I guess. Probably go fight a teacher in a fate and power of the wild. I believe I did that last Get time. Fight, Ooh, this seems like an aggro. This is yeah. This is this is like the warrior version. Now I am building up a hand, but I'm going to be getting rid of that literally a second. But yeah, I'm enjoying the token. I really used the token. See, it would work with these and all. But we're just going to go straight up with the Inner Fate and then the Power of the Wild play. So we're just going to do that. There, as I said, there is a 4-4 inside that egg. But the only issue is, I feel like the computer's just going to hit my two minions here. Get the 4-4 out, I'll probably hit it with the 4-6. Don't really want to, but I have to. Uh, most likely I'll go with the Gnomish Infenta. But the Haunted Creeper is a very interesting card, I will admit that. Wow. That's how Rain of Fire works. Is it selected? So that's what it looks like, alright. The, the Undertaker, the one card, that one card that no one wants to fight. Does that include enemy? Whenever you summon, ah, whenever you summon one, yeah, okay, fair enough. So... But it seems... Is it fair to do this play? I'm thinking of putting the one... Uh, putting 1-1 one, one on these two. 
make a not free free so I can send a free free in no a free free into that and then the free two into that hero hit hero hit that leaves me up with a free two well I can do an alternate play and play a no Mitch get rid of these two into that but that would be a threat so it isn't the best play but it's the only play I got at the meantime I probably could have done something better but I'm not a pro. I'm not like those pros you see, like on Twitch and so on in tournaments. So I'm gonna just send that into this. And some name Grand Widow. I don't actually recall her if she was a like a sub box in that realm. It has been quite some time since those days, though. Since my, since you know the Lich King. Days. I think that was the time where I started playing, to be honest. With Warcraft. Slay them in the master's name. Your hero has plus one attack on your turn. Hmm. The widow embraces oh, me. damn. Worship. Oh, that. Oh, ow, I hit my arm. That was a strong play. Hmm. What do I can do against that? No. Knife Juggler, no Mish. I know it ain't the best play, but the only issue is because this is becoming troublesome. Swipe is great here. Oh, Swipe will be perfect. If they don't kill off the No Mish Inventor, probably gonna send the No Mish Inventor into the 1 2, no 1 3. Swipe, the obvious play. Unless I get some big taunters coming out of nowhere. Please forgive if you hear a motorbike outside, because I can hear that guy popping about nowhere. Okay, I wasn't even looking at screen. Rampage. Ooh, now this is painful. This is very painful indeed. Let's have a look what I can do then. Swipe? Plus shapeshift? Hmm. Swipe will have to be played, will have to be played, definitely. Hmm. But the Druid of the Claws, though. Druid of Claw. Hmm. Druid of Claw seems like a good play, but not really, if that makes any sense. As in, I could Druid of the Claw, hit the 1 2 so it doesn't gain any extra attack. Armor up, hit him in the face, or he could just summon, actually, yeah, probably just summon the Haunted Creeper. Because all he has to do is send the 4 2 and himself into it, into my Druid of the Claw. Hmm. Swipe plus Gnomich into the Worshipper, get rid of it. Plus the Shapeshift will get rid of this guy, but leaving him with one Worshipper. Now I either leave it to whatever play they will do, which is an ideal, but I think I will have to get a taunt up. But I'm not sure if that's the right play yet. Oh, we're, we'll go with it for now, because I'm swiping next turn, that's inevitable. Swipe will be played next turn, at least. So at least we know Grand Widow Fan Fa 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 is the equivalent of Warrior. And the last guy was the equivalent of a warlock. Hmm. That rain of fire hero ability though is quite quite strong, I will admit. Right. Will they hit it with their face? Okay, that what's what I want to happen. The opponent draws a card. Interesting. Oh, Rain of Fire. Ooh, Rain of Fire did not help them. I'm probably just gonna swipe the Dancing Swords to get a good card. No, get a card. The 1-1 one, one into the... 4-1? Yeah. Seems reasonable. I guess. Here we go with this. Get a card. Summon Knife. Oh damn, I just realised what I did, but we'll see what happens. Because they're probably going to get a new tool. Oh, 
That was good. Yes, we know you failed, you worshippers. I don't like those worshippers. They're quite ridiculous. I believe that's going to be my next card, though, the worshipper. Might work. Might work in this deck. Not, not really, though. I think that would be more, as it is on here, warrior-based. Are these Spectra? Yeah, Spectra Spiders, yep. Three. If, if I can make them get rid of my knife juggler, that would be perfect. I want... Okay, I'm going to send my 3-2 into their 2-3 unless they do the same. Wow, it's like it's an actual player. <laughs> do I want life? Do I want life this turn? Not really. Don't really want life. I want more like I need cards, because I'm running out of cards right now. Now I can draw two. I hope I get my Ancient of War, because that would be perfect about now. Uh, could summon a Haunted Creeper. Yeah, Haunted Creeper, because I'll win next turn with the Savage combo. Yeah. So, so far, next for Armus. It's great. I'm loving it so far. I know the tone of my voice doesn't make it seem like I'm enjoying it that much, but it's very... I need the focus, because all these new cards are a mystery to me. Hmm. Is this a win for me? I believe so. One moment. Five. Six. Yeah. I believe it's GG. We'll go with it anyway. Yep, yeah, definitely GG. <laughs> me and my maths is crap. I feel like one of those torrenty players, you know, hit the opponent slowly. But I'm not. There you go. No, they won't. Trust me. Trust me, they won't. But that was a very, very difficult fight, I will admit, like the Failing previous games. Means nothing. The Spider Queen will dispatch you easily. Okay, and what happens if I kill the Spider Queen? <laughs> I get the worshippers, I'm guessing. Um, do I click something? Will I be stuck on this page forever? Stay tuned. Because I believe... Yep, something's happening. Uh... Wow. Okay, sure. See you in a minute. Blizzard has done it again. The uh, Naxxaramas has crashed on me. It's crashed globally, I believe. Because everyone's saying they can't get in Hearthstone. It's all over Twitter and so on. I'm not sure how long it's going to pass. But I want to show you the first two mini-bosses, sub-bosses, if you will, of the first wing. So the next part should be out either soon or tomorrow. It really depends. Now, thank you for understanding and so on. And also, thanks to it crashing, I can't put up the deck list on the side. But that'll change. That'll change for part two, hopefully. Thank you for watching. Bye.